just went up at the end. What did you think? I can't believe it. It was nowhere near five minutes. I don't know why there was injury time. No and main injuries. So what, what's, your, what's your predictions for the rest of the season? Going on to Monday at Milton Keynes? Uh, Milton Keynes is going to be a tough game, but I think we should finish it, yeah. And you've got to put 50 quid on playoffs or straight up or missing out? Playoffs, I reckon. I don't know. Sorry. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Be close enough. Oh, relieved, relieved. <laughs> when, he, when he saw five minutes go up, <laughs> what, what, what did you think was going to happen? <laughs> See, Notts County from years ago, they were going to equalise, but we held on. We deserved that as well. So when we go for bit, a bit of a nervy ending, what did you think in the last five minutes? Oh, I, I, thought we'd held, I thought we'd hold on. I thought we had it in us. Um, it was hairy, but I think it's pretty much always hairy at Brentford. Um, yeah, they did really, really well to hold on. and. And yeah, so it's coming thick and fast now. So we move on Monday. MK Dons, what's your prediction there? I don't want to dare make a prediction. <laughs> I think we'll do really. I hope for a win. Um, I think any less than a draw will be disappointing. But, and um, your gut feeling for the rest of the season: straight up playoffs or miss out? I think we're straight up. First or second? I think second. I hope first thing. <laughs> Who cares, eh? Well, as long as you go up. Go oh, Bruce! So happy today. You're obviously <laughs> superly happy, like you know. I'm pretty happy. Pretty nerve jingling at the end, though, right? You know, that's what happens. It'll be on Brentford in Brentford, isn't it? Yeah, you know, one goal One goal wins all the way to the end of the season. That's the way it goes. So, first off, so game of two hours, you'd say? No, it's a game of domination by the Bees until the last 15 minutes. A ridiculous penalty. Don't know where that came from. Should have followed up. Then we looked a bit jittery, so nerve jangling at the end. But come on, Who's we came through. Anyone stood out for you? I thought Shane and Logan had a great game um, and he got a man of the match. Um, we also... Adjemi. Yeah, Adjemi was right. He had a really good game as well. Right, yeah. and, their, and their keeper who disappeared in the, at half time for a quick bath? Well, their second keeper didn't look any better, to be honest. Yeah, we can see right through <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think the crowd got on top of him a little bit, both of them. So, yeah. Go B. It's great atmosphere today as well. It's fantastic. I think we're close to that. When you saw five minutes go up at the end, what did you think? I just thought... <laughs> can they just go like that? Bad substitutions today, I'm afraid. Mad or bad? Bad. Bad substitutions. I thought Tom was doing really well. Um, I don't know why he brought Sam off. Unbelievable, really. I think 2 0, we would have gone on to 3 4 0, I thought, with that team out there. Good thing was Bradley got off the mark, and I think that will be set us for the next few games now. We're counting the games down now. We've got Milton Keynes on Monday. What's your prediction for Monday, and then going forward from there? What, what, what's, your, what's your feeling after that? It's going to be a tight game Monday, obviously they've got a result today, they've still got an outside chances of playoffs. But if we play like we did in the first or after the first 10 minutes today until we scored, then we have match for any bonus division as we proved all season. Um, we need to kill teams off when we're on top of them though, that's been our problem I think most of the season. Um, and hanging on in the end there was a bit nerve wracking. But we're in a good position now, we'd have taken this before the season started. But it's going to be a nervous time for us. A couple of people moaning about the substitutions again today. What do you, what do you think about the, the substitutions? Um, well, it's a difficult one because obviously winning is important. Um, I don't like it, as most fans don't, when we go defensive. Um, shows a bit of negativity. I thought the front two were working quite well and I think that when Mike Phillips come off, we did look a bit more lightweight up front. Overall, though, we can't complain. Three points. So, going up, playoffs or missing out? Going up just last day of the season, job again like ready, only this time to get the right result. We're getting closer now. Are you pleased with that then? Am I pleased with that? Yes. Yeah. I'm fucking relieved. Yeah. Sorry, I'm awfully relieved. So happy with that then? Yeah, we're happy with that. First yeah. half, should have waited first half, yeah. second half. Yeah. Rode a little bit, second half. Do you think your nerves in the second half? What, 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 yeah, what do you think the wrong? Second half, I think. Right I think Donaldson had a bad game today, but he's had a good game the rest of the season, so. I think he should have gone off rather than uh, Bradley White Phillips, but well on Monday. What do you, what do you, what's, what's, the, what's your vibe? What do you think when, when the referee holds five minutes up? Um, hang on and take three points. That's about it, mate. Just run around and get three points. And go and taking that into Monday? Yeah, man, it's good. Um, obviously, three points. It's a big weekend. We're going to hopefully get six points and then move right up the table. Obviously, Doncaster lost a herd, so it's good news for us. So you, you fit? Yeah, I'm fit. 